Hey everyone, so I am back today with a Bratz haul video. I've actually not done one of these probably in like four, four years, three, four, five years. I don't know. I actually just recently got a ton of like literally like used dolls. Oh my gosh, that was like half of them off of eBay and stuff recently just because I really, um, wanted to get a few select dolls to try rerouting because I've rerouted Monster High dolls and I figured I wanted to give Brat dolls a try. Um, and, I, and there was a few specific ones I really wanted their faces. I tried to get um, a few for like posable bodies and stuff and I'll tell you about that adventure in like two seconds. But I just kind of wanted to show you guys um, my finds that I got. Make sure that I have them all because I am surrounded by a ton of dolls. And yes, I do have them all. Okay. So we're going to start this off with this really, really awesome Moxie girl that I got. <laughs> um, I actually have no idea who she is. I can tell she's like one of the older ones because she has the flatter hands, but her hair is quite a bit of a mess. So uh, there's her. I have Pampered Pets Chloe. Pampered Pups. Sorry, Pampered Pups Chloe. She's the one that came with the little puppy and the little shower that you could like rinse off the dirt. I have Yasmin for her, so she was one um, that I was excited to get. Um... A lot of these dolls have like marks on their bodies and on their faces and a lot of their hair is, they're, they're just awful. I was actually quite disappointed with most of these. Um, I've tried to remove some of the marks and stuff so far and I've kind of done some work on some of their hair and then there's some that I have not which I'll show you. Like this scary girl here. This is um, Nighty Night Yasmin. She is from the 2009 edition. When they came with like a little plastic pets, hers was like a little plastic pink and green dinosaur. So there's her. To go along with her, I got the Nighty Night Sasha from 2009 as well. She's another fun one I'm going to try and um, fix the hair of after this video. Uh, to go along with um, the hair trend, I have uh, Cowgirl's 2009 Sasha edition. I love her face and unfortunately my camera's probably not going to want to... Be very, very nice right now. So, uh, there is Sasha. Love her face. Um, to go along with that, I have Cowgirls Chloe from the 2009 um, series. Love her face as well. I also have uh, Chloe the Babysitter from the Bratz World Edition. I believe that looked like her, so I'm just, I'm just guessing, but I'm, I, I can guarantee almost that that's her. Love her face screening. Oh, love it. Um, I also, I believe I'm correct on this too, that this is Bratz World Chloe, the one with the bedroom set. Um, not the with the bed, but with the vanity and uh, the closet. So that's her. I have Bratz costume. I'm not sure if this is just called costume or costume bash. Uh, this is Yasmin and she is the bumblebee. Also love her screening. I have Neon Pop Divas Yasmin, who I already have, so she will be going in the set-aside pile. I have Treasures Roxy, which I'm not sure if the camera's going to pick up, but she's got, like, this awesome, like, mark across her forehead. It's, like, this this massive line, but I have her, and also her leg has been chewed, so that's fun. Um, one of the only dolls I got dressed, Platinum Shimmers Chloe. I got uh, the Bratz, the movie, Yasmin, and um, Chloe 2-pack. Where is Chloe? There she is. And these were the two that came in the pink and purple uh, little shirt and pants uh, outfit from the end of the movie when they're doing their dance on the stage. These two were one of the main reasons I bought one of the lots. Um, I cleaned up Yasmin's face a little bit. Hers was really, really bad. But as you can see, she's missing um, that little extra piece on her arm. So the seller didn't include that. So one of her arms is longer than the other, which is fun. And then I got Chloe with two right hands, which is um, also a blast as well. Woohoo. So that's fun. So a little bummed about that. I contacted her and she said that her daughter had a bunch of dolls. So she'll be going through. So I'm really hoping she can find them. Uh, this one, I actually have no idea who it is if someone could verify this for me i no it's not pampered pets chloe um i actually have no idea who this is not off the top of my head so if someone could tell me that'd be great and she's 
quite scuffed up as you can see so that's the downside to her got another fun Avery moxie girl I got um, some boy doll to be honest I'm not sure who he is the boy dolls I tend to kind of forget about and then they just kind of come and go I got secret date Megan who would have been an awesome find except she's um missing a chunk from her eyebrow and she's got like dirt on her face and a mark off her cheek so a little bummed but got her and Megan's witch costume which is fun um got another moxie girl I got Sophina I got some kids snap on Yasmin I got Cella Bratson uh it's supposed to be celebration, but celebrates, and it sounds weird, really weird to say. But I got Yasmin. I had a couple of her, so she will be up for grabs. I got one of uh, the twin Moxie girls that was released. I I don't remember their name, but I got her partial outfit. Got another kid snap on Chloe. Her hair is one that I straightened and um fixed a little bit. It was like Yasmin, so it was really bad. But her hair is kind of not the best, but it's down now. I got a uh, 2010 Party Yasmin. Love her. I got, um, her hair is quite big too, but I got Bratz Cat Sasha. Gonna use her body for fun stuff. I got Camp Fire Phoebe in a lot of her outfit. I do have her already too. I actually have most of these, to be honest. A lot of them I just kind of wanted unposable bodies and to change around and stuff. So I got, um, Dana, first edition Dana. I, to be honest, not first edition. But the one where she was released, I don't remember if this is Strut It. I'm going to say Strut It. Don't quote me. It might be. But she's in second edition Chloe's outfit. I have Step Out Yasmin in first edition Yasmin's outfit. I actually love her screening. Love the glitter eyes. I always love that. Glitter lips and glitter eyes were my favorite for the brats. And she has blonde curly hair, which looks really, really awesome on Yasmin. So... See if I can make this a smidge brighter. I don't know what's going on with my camera. So that's her. Sorry about the quality too. Like the camera is just not the best. Uh, I have Express It Megan. This is her first release. Um, she will be one up for grabs. So I got her just kind of in a second outfit for when she can find her new home. I have Funkin' Glow Chloe from 2012 edition and her lights still work. Fortunately, she's missing like the top part of her dress, so that was a bummer. But I did fix her hair as well. I straightened it and brushed it and stuff, because it was a huge mess too. Um, I have walking Chloe, who doesn't really walk anymore. Like her legs work a little bit, but like when she has shoes on, they don't work. Sadly, I don't have her, so I would um, love to keep her. So I'll have to fix her up a little bit. She's got a mark on her leg, but overall, she's all right. And I got a uh, little Angel's Chloe, half of a Bratz Kids Yasmin doll, um, another Bratz Babies Yasmin, another Bratz Babies Yasmin, um, some Clo some ballerina Chloe doll. She's all right. And then a pony. So that was basically it for my Bratz haul. Um, let me know what you guys think down in the comment section. Who is your favorite? Um, also what I will do is cause a lot of these will probably be going up on eBay. Um, I'll leave a link to my eBay down in the uh, description. I'm going to be charging $5 a doll. They'll probably be in like separate lots. So you'll, you can get a certain amount at a time. So I'll try and fix these up. There will be some that will unfortunately not be able to be fixed up. So just keep that in mind if you are looking to purchase. Um, so yeah, thank you guys for watching. Stay tuned for the next video and I'll see you later. Bye.